dream of trying to play me Gazing on days and contagious show my baby We know each other like the back of our hands Understand there's no mistake and I'm taking this show my dream What's good YouTube? It's your girl Asia And it's your boy BJ Back in the building Back in effect Back, back like, like we, we never, never left, left. You amped up today. Hey y'all, I'm ready tonight. I'm amped up tonight. I'm ready to get into this today. Cause we got a new artist today. But today y'all, we're getting into Burden featuring Mises. It's called Ride For Me. Uh, this is actually a suggestion via donation from one of our loyal supporters. Before we even get into this reaction, we always gotta send a shout out and we always got, we always gotta send that love back. We definitely appreciate you supporting the channel. Thank you so much for believing in us. Appreciate your loyalty, man, and just holding us down. Yeah. We really appreciate it, it means a lot. Definitely. But before we get into this video, if y'all are new to this channel, we welcome you. Welcome y'all with open arms. Welcome. Go ahead and hit that like button. Go ahead and comment and subscribe. Smash that notification bell. So when these videos get uploaded, y'all gonna be the first ones to see Asia and BJ. <laughs> so y'all, without any further ado, y'all, let's go ahead and check out Burden featuring Mises. Ride for me. Well, to start this video, that's not a very good position to be in. No. <laughs> no. This is starting off on the wrong foot. Okay. A bit. What's this called again? It's called Ride For Me. You know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> and it got cops involved? Okay. I don't yeah. know yet, y'all. I don't yeah. know. This, he already started out on, on the issue, okay? Yeah, he held that gunpoint. Number one. So he he, he might have fit the description. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe not. What if I was on my knees and executed by police? What if I was being choked and they knew that I couldn't breathe? If I was in the mm. cop car, was killed in the back seat, with hands cuffed and locked behind me, y'all ain't losing any sleep. Ain't nobody about to ride for me, and that's a fact. Ain't no protest with signs for me, cause I ain't black. Ain't no hashtags uh. online for me, or fighting back. Ain't nobody about to ride for me, bet y'all don't ride for me. Ain't it demonic how the news make a piece of shit look like. Wait. Wait, wait. <laughs> he said, ain't nobody gonna ride for me. Who, who gonna do it? You know what I mean? It's only, it's only a few loyal few that's gonna actually ride for you in the end. Wait, but is he just talking about like nobody gonna ride for him because he not black? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, ain't nobody gonna <clears throat> ride for him because he, he, you know, he, he, he looked the way he looked. Cause, why? Cause he don't have the complexion for the protection. I don't know. That's what I'm trying to figure out because he's like, you know, what if it's me? What if, what if I'm held down on the ground and I can't breathe? You know what I mean? Are they gonna ride for me? Yeah, so that's what that's kind of what we're talking about. We already know he's kind of going down down that trail as far as like police brutality. I know, in but I'm just trying to figure you know? out like why would he say that? You know what I mean? Like why would he say like is he saying it just because like because they keep bringing attention to like the black lives that in, like encounter these issues that that that's the reason why they get riots and they get protests and 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 somebody gonna ride for them? I think he's putting it in the context. It's kind of what you're saying as far as like BLM. Um, as far as these movements that's been put together, uh, you know, for black people in regards to them being um, brutally, um, you know, you know, being brutalized by the police. Mm -hmm. But I feel like, you know, since since he's not black, he's kind of asking that same question because uh, this came out, what, a week ago? And, you know, a lot of these like these issues are, are festering as far as like a lot of police brutality on black people. But and, then and they I guess go the light like isn't on. You know they don't really shine a light like you said on like the other complexion yeah i feel yeah i and i can see that too and, and i think he's which hispanic is, right i don't know which is kind of like what we were talking about a while back in, in terms of like you know hell even ryan kind of mentioned it in his video like in terms of like just bringing attention to certain things and issues where it's like you got to tiptoe around certain people because of what's being like you know showed in front of the media for people to see and i'm like well, why wouldn't he? I mean, because, you know, at the end of the day, I guess that's kind of falling into the category of all lives matter. It's just like, you know, are you going to have the same riots and the same protests for somebody that's white that had to encounter the same thing? Because at the end of the day, to call it for what it is, it's very plausible mm -hmm. or likely that they do the same shit to white people. Right. You know what I mean? Or, that that they're going color. to black people. Right. Only like right now, it's just like it's the spotlight is put on black people because this shit is happening to everybody. Mexican, yeah, to, white, yeah, Asian, you know what I mean? It doesn't matter. 
I think so too. But at the end of the day, I still feel like it, it is it is being done to more proportionately black people. But at the same time, it doesn't take away the fact that it's been ha it's happening to a lot of people. Right. Every day, day in and day out. But the light doesn't get shown on it. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Man, wherever wrong is being done, shine a light on it. Yeah. It doesn't matter about your complexion or your color. Ride for me, bitch, y'all don't ride for me. Yeah, ain't it demonic? How the news make a piece of shit look iconic. How ironic. If the ratings go up, so does the profits. You can change the station, but the... If the ratings go up, so do, so do the profits. It does. It, it, it absolutely does. That's which, is, which is what I just said. You know yep. what I mean? They gonna bring the shit that people are gonna, like, emphasize and highlight and capture and encapsulate and just invent like they just have it's 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 you're being trained people yeah. you know I mean? like it, 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 i mean to just call it you know yeah call it for what it is yeah. call it what it is baby tell them. yeah i mean they only gonna show i mean for the ratings for the ratings you know <laughs> what i mean just remember that because just because something is happening to to one race in particular don't think for a second that this shit is not happening to other people like that are not black. Like, right. don't think for a quick second that it's not. Right. And, let, and, and let's just take, you know, one account that happened recently in regards to, like, George Floyd and, and what was done to him by the police officer. You know, you know, soon as something like that happens and, and, and you know, the media gets a hold of it and, you know, Black Lives Matter comes in and, and they start... Uh, you know, bringing light to it and saying things in regards to it mm -hmm. and creating protests, that's when the media comes in and then they want to s sensationalize um, an already, you know, chaotic situation or chaotic uh, chain of events. And, and all they do all day is just run it on replay and sensationalize it. Right. And just like you said, they do it for, for the ratings. Mm -hmm. You know, they're not, to a degree, that they, they're bringing awareness to it, but at the same time, you know, they're in it for their pockets too. Right. You know. It's a profit. Yeah. At the end of the day, it's a profit. <laughs> I like in this video, I started laughing. It said, white dogs matter. It's almost like saying that, you know, you can come up with any type of movement and they're going to put it on, on TV. They're going to blast it all over social media. And all it does is it does this right here. Yep. It just causes a divide. Yep. Iconic, how ironic. If the ratings go up, so does the profits. You can change the station, but the reading from the same strip. White man gunned down by police. Ain't nobody play that clip. <laughs> no one gave a shit. I won't get no famous case. I won't get no downtown monument where they paint my face. I won't get mm. no NFL jersey spot that say my say name. My oh, name. that's right. Since I'm white, the situation ain't the, ain't same. the same. Black lives matter. Asian lives matter. Spanish lives matter. Ain't allowed to say Caucasian lives matter. Why? That don't fit the narrative. Man, I appreciate him for saying that. Yeah. Thank you so much. I just said all <laughs> lives matter. Yeah, all because they do. Yeah. Great point that he made. Lives matter, Spanish lives matter. Ain't allowed to say Caucasian lives matter. Why? That don't mm. fit the narrative. That will mean equality. equality. Truth in the mainstream media. That's mythology. They've been using my people, uh. your people, good people, poor people. Either we wake up or they gonna keep on using more people. I tried to warn people, supply them the truth. If the victim was me, y'all wouldn't ride. Alone. What if I was on my knees and executed by police? What if I was being choked and they knew that I couldn't breathe? If I was in the cop car, was killed in the back seat with hands cuffed. A lot behind me, y'all ain't losing any sleep. Ain't nobody about to ride from me. You, you notice, you kind of notice in the video, it, like it, it's, it's kind of like the roles, are, the roles are kind of reversed. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> you know, you know, now you have a a, a white. Well, that's that's what I was explaining at the very beginning. Yeah, yeah. Now, now he's a white guy with a black cop. Right. Yeah. That's why I was saying what I said. Like, yeah. don't think for a second that this isn't happening to white people. Yeah. You know what I mean? <clears throat> it's just not being shown like it is right now for the for for black people. Right. Great. But it, but it's happening. Trust great, and believe that. Great case in point. And see, that's the thing that the media is doing. You know, they're, they're trying to put that at the forefront uh, to a degree to make it seem like that it's, it's so many more black people that's being brutalized and beat up by police. But, well, statistically, but they're not. But they're, but they're not telling the whole entire story. They're just yeah. trying to focus in and home in on, on one particular complexion of people, which which is us. And I'm just like, y'all, like, don't don't keep the spotlight on us. Like, show everything that's going on. Right. Yeah. With hands cuffed and locked behind me, y'all ain't losing any sleep. Ain't nobody got to ride from me, and that's a fact. Ain't no protest with signs for me, cause I ain't black. Ain't no hashtags online for me, or fighting back. Ain't nobody got to ride from me, bet y'all don't ride from me. Uh, uh, 
This is so exhausting. Way the news talking. It's like black folks only ones dead in coffins. Black on black ain't a tragedy, huh? Guess news cameras ran out of batteries, huh? Live by the gun, die by the gun. When it happens in the hood, y'all ain't saying none. But soon as that trigger finger white, y'all be tearing shit up on the same night. Say I ain't right. Say I ain't white, let's say that I'm black okay. Get pulled over, try to run away and scrap Reaching for the strap, but he get it first So I slug him in the face at the same time that it burst Now I'm just another reason to ride a name on a shirt When the truth is I just got what I deserve When you playing dumb games and you win a dumb prize Less is white, killing blacks, they don't give a fuck who dies nah. When you gonna realize they just trying to divide Come on. red, white, and blue, it's the color Mises, he's on it. Ain't that what you just say? <laughs> yeah. And they just trying to divide us? They're you know what to, I mean? They, and they're doing a good job of it because Yo. they can, because they continue to divide us. At the end of the day, um, again, like again, I, I'm very, I'm a very, very proud black man. You know, very, very proud black person in America. But still, at the same time, like you, you got, you got to call it for what it is. Yeah. And and you can no longer have the wool pulled over your eyes. You know, you can no longer be. You know, a wolf in sheep's clothing. Like you really gotta like stand up and and see things for what they are. Let me pop your shoulder, y'all. She dislocated her shoulder a couple of years back. I'm gonna pop it. <laughs> I think this song speaks for itself. I mean, it says everything that you know what I mean. We've we've previously spoke about in terms of like the division. The you know what I mean. Like yeah. what's being brought into the forefront for people to see, for people to believe, for people to kind of highlight on, like. I just feel like, you know what I mean? And, and in, in a way, I'm actually kind of glad that this song was made because it's like, if you think, like I said before, if you think for one second that this is only happening to black people, like you've been fooled, you know what I mean? And he 1000% is explaining that. He's like, well, is anybody going to ride for me? Like, are y'all going to make this a big deal because it was yeah. me? Now you we're understanding what ride for me mean now. Yeah. That's what he's saying. Right. Yeah. So... I just, I just, you know, I feel like he's speaking from, from all race perspectives, particularly, you know what I mean? Like white people, different races other than black people, because we're already being brought into the forefront. I feel like we've gotten the attention that we need to bring awareness to what is going on in the world, mm -hmm. but it's not the attention that we need to have in terms of like bringing like unitation, like just uniting people together, you know what I mean, as one, because it is indivisibly <clears throat> dividing everybody, mm -hmm. you know what I mean, it to is. make these these pre, like these judgments of people. Yeah, and it's okay, um, and, and I'm, I'm probably fine. You and know. I say people as in people start having these perspectives about cops, like all cops are not bad cops, mm -hmm. you know what I mean, but... Here recently, if you think about everything that's been going on, it's just like these, the light that has been brought to freaking blue lives lately is just horrendous. You know what I mean? You would think every one of them out there is, are the worst people in the world. Mm -hmm. like, And they're not. Right. You know what I mean? Right. But it's the light that's being brought to them. It's just like, man, like I feel right. like they should be highlighting more about what officers are doing that's good right. to, to continue to give people the thoughts of thinking that cops are not bad people. Right. You know what I mean? Instead of highlighting all the time and on all these bad things and what this cop did and who this cop killed like let's talk about what the good cops did you mm -hmm. know what I mean because I'm sure they did a whole lot more right <laughs> and, and they're I, doing a lot more yeah and they're doing a lot more they're influencing a lot more than than what they're giving credit for that part yeah. Playing dumb games and you win a dumb prize. Less is white, killing blacks. They don't give a fuck who dies. Nah. When you gonna realize they just trying to divide us? Red, white, and blue. It's the colors that unite us. I'm getting sick and tired of the looting and the rides. When the truth is, if I was dead, then y'all be dead silent. What if I was on my knees and executed by police? by police? What if I was being choked and they knew that I couldn't breathe? I couldn't if I was breathe. in the cop car, was killed in the back seat, with hands cuffed a lot behind me, y'all ain't losing any sleep. Ain't nobody about to ride from me, and that's a fact. Ain't no protest with signs for me, cause I ain't black. Ain't no hashtags online for me, or fighting back. Ain't nobody about mm. to ride for me, bet y'all don't ride for me. Mm. It's a good one. That was a good one. Yeah. This I mean, is a good song. Yeah, it's a cool song. It's, it's definitely an eye opener, mm -hmm. if anything. Um, I just like his perspective. You know, I'm cool with his perspective. You know, given 
you know, like flipping the roles, you know what I mean? Yeah. You know, being a, a white person that's being jumped on by a bunch of black people, and now he's screaming saying that he can't breathe. Yeah. You know, at the end of the day, if it if if, if it's police brutality on on anybody, you know, on any human being, if there's police brutality on any human being, it's wrong. Mm-hmm. And it's, and there should be something done about it. It should be brought to the light. Yeah. You know, we got to continue to get on a path where we're not divided. But even with, with the police brutality, when the Black Lives Movement started, like I was okay with it because I'm like, okay, now now they're kind of bringing light to, to a problem that's been happening for a very, very long time. Right. Um, but then when all these other people start coming out with out of the woodworks with, you know, these lives matter and these lives matter and these lives matter, now, now it's just completely dividing everything. And, and, and I'm gonna be honest, like with, with the Black Lives Movement, it's dividing people too at the same time, you yeah. know what I mean? But I, I just feel like there has to be something done outside of that, you know? Yeah, you can have your own movement, but what are you gonna do to bring it together? Right. You know, that's the next question. Mm-hmm. And, and it's okay for people to say, okay, blue lives matter, black lives matter, white lives matter, orange lives matter, purple lives matter. Okay, cool, but at the end of the day, how do we unite that and bring all that together as one? I truly believe that, yeah. like, come on. I agree. I yeah, mean, too. I don't really have anything to add. You said it all. Really? Yeah. If y'all enjoyed this video, please be sure you give us a big thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any videos from Asia and BJ. Absolutely. And if ain't nobody told you, I love you. And we're going to see y'all in the next video, y'all. See your body.